everybody welcome to perfectly imperfect me i am standile ngosi today i am inviting you into my bedroom to watch me get unready and get settled in for bed so please make sure that you subscribe you hit the click i'm getting it wrong let's let's start again let's start again so please make sure that you hit the bell notification that you hit the subscribe as well also make sure that you hit the like if you like this whole video basically just stay tuned and see if you like it okay i'm just gonna show you a couple of products that i use some of it is new some of it is old but bear with me i'm just gonna be getting unready and just getting very ready for bed so if you're hearing some noises my mom is in the lounge she is watching some TV, she's watching Rats all day life. Anybody knows about that? That's like um, that's like TLC for South Africans. It's really good. It's really good. Okay. Um. Basically, today was a very eventful day. I've got a lot going on currently in my life, and um, I haven't been shooting in a while, and um with good reason of course with good reason um i just had a lot going on in my life and i just wanted to take a step back and really reassess my life and um <coughs> plan my next move basically and we're just gonna readjust the lighting excuse me so um i have a lot going on in my life currently um i'm currently planning a whole move um I haven't even told anyone about it. You guys are the only ones that know about it. So don't tell nobody. So I'm planning that. And I've just been going to auditions back to back. Um, I've been really tired, fatigued. But it's just genuinely the whole year is fatigue. It's just piling up. And yeah, but I'm okay. I'm okay. Let's start with the face, yeah? So I'm going to wear these just for control, okay? Um, hoping that you hear me and that the sound quality is much better this time. So I'm going to be melting off my makeup. Um, I'm going to be going in with a cleansing balm. If you like a regular on my, on my channel, like I know I don't post regularly, but if you are a day one, you'll know that I usually use this um, Bobbi Brown tiny little bobby brown cleansing oil i've run out of that it's completely gone so now i went out to uh, i think this game and i got myself this uh pons cleansing balm it looks like that it's gonna be my first time using it i've never used this before so it comes with a spatula like a little scoop my day and when you're done using it if you pop it back in here however you pop it okay um hold on there <coughs> you pop it like that oh. and um it's got that pop that off with a little protective lid and that is the baby so i would love to i'm so i'm so scared <sighs> it's so perfect okay but we need to try it okay so okay it looks like coconut oil I don't know why that was so weird. Um, I don't know why I used my fingers. I missed like how old it's going. <laughs> Sorry guys, long day. Um, just gonna show you what it looks like. Okay, looks like wax. Um, but you see, like there's there's lotion, a bit of. I don't know, like wax let's see what it looks like on the face hmm it smells really nice hmm 
It does smell nice. I think a little really goes a long way. I don't know if you can open your eyes. No. Not that it's stingy in the eyes, just that there's makeup just going everywhere. So I don't think it would be allowed. What I really like about this is that a little goes a long way. Um, but I feel like I really just bit off a whole chunk, so I didn't really need that much. But I don't know, tell me what you think. I normally struggle with my eye area. If I am wearing like eye makeup, I usually struggle with removing it and I'm not one to tug my skin ever since I learned that tugging your skin really just like makes it worse for the long run or in the long run excuse me okay it doesn't really sting um, but it's just not comfortable in the eyes just because it's oil so you will feel oil on your eyes if you do open them um, but it's not really stingy I just don't feel comfortable opening my eyes um, with foreign stuff in my eyes okay so right now because I'm a little far away from the bathroom I'm really lazy to get up so I'm just gonna cut it short in that I am going to use these wipes I Ow! Don't come for me. I know what I said. Uh, 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 Don't. Uh, Stop. Ah! Uh, uh. Stop! <laughs> Don't come for me. But I'm just gonna use it because I'm really far away and I'm I'm lazy. I'm... Yeah, I said it. I'm lazy. Fuck it. So, I'm just gonna take one. As you can see, like it's literally rubbing off because of this. I'm just gonna start with my fingers remove that so I just want to read what it says um, and what it promises this nourishing formula transforms from soft balm to silky oil instantly melting away even waterproof mascara well makeup rather while deeply nourishing your skin easy rinse off non-drying 100% French rose extract formula that makes sense from the scent but it's a really soft and gentle scent it's not something that would um, make you throw up yeah unless you're the really that sensitive then yeah no sure so I'm gonna be going in with my oh I'm sorry for the packaging my vibes from skin strategy I bought these myself I'm not sponsored yet uh, so, um, I I always find that with these wipes or just wipes in general, you constantly have to go in multiple times just wiping and tugging at your skin which is something i don't really enjoy doing because my skin goes red it goes red um and it just feels rough at the end of the day so that's not nice it's not a nice feeling to have you know it's really not so i want to go and take a shower I'm just unwind from the day i've been driving around a lot a lot so i just wanna relax put in some bath bombs 
and some put on some nice music and some salt that's the word i was looking for salt not salt um look at how dirty the motherfucking is um i'm going to just play the second one it's because i'm super pedantic about having makeup on like i feel like every time i do makeup and every time i go excuse me every time i do my makeup for auditions it literally always reminds me why i don't like putting on makeup it's time consuming and my skin feels like it can't breathe like it feels like it can't breathe because it's hugging and absorbing all of the oils and it's absorbing um makeup it's absorbing um the pollution in the sky it's a mess it's a mess it's a mess so it's something i don't really enjoy nowadays and every time i have to go to an audition it reminds me shit I'm not gonna be able to wear my natural skin or maybe i can i just haven't found the castings that would allow me to do that um because now i'm at least a little more comfortable and braver to go out barefaced um so i want to start doing that but you know you gotta always come up with a with a face always look cute you know, be presentable but who's to say that your natural skin is not presentable but that's a topic for another day I just feel like having makeup and no shade to anyone who loves makeup I think I love makeup too it's an art form it's 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 a way of therapy for other people it's for other people it, it could be anything for you um, but my my thing is my relationship with with makeup has always been um, I wouldn't say love hate but it has always been weird it's always been in a weird place where I enjoy putting it on and I enjoy doing it but the fact that I'm gonna have to sweat it off or wear a mask and it's gonna melt that really puts me off and and um, back then i used to, i feel like i used to wear makeup for the wrong reasons now i'm wearing it for all the right reasons so like if i need to look go look for a job go pant then sure um definitely i will wear, wear a face because i want to look presentable for work for a certain character um that the brief is is, is looking for so um i just feel like there <clears throat> just feel like that yeah, i felt like i've been wearing makeup for all the wrong reasons and now that i'm getting older i'm at a point where i respect my skin now and i'm at a point where i i really and truly appreciate what it looks like and what it is and how far it's come to 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 look the way that it does i'm really proud of it i'm really proud of it hold on a bit i'm just gonna go get cotton buds and um just go in here with my tight line and just remove the black because i don't want to sleep with like looking like a raccoon in my shape guys we're back so i'm done wiping off my face right now i'm just gonna go in with my micellar my water and some cotton buds and just take care of my ass because okay so there's not much it removed wow okay you know what i actually should have checked the bomb how good it is so i can review it but you know what? they're not paying me so i'm just gonna show you how i get unready um yeah i'm just gonna do that Let's see i'm just gonna go in with my 
really 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 magnified um <laughs> mirror and out okay maybe not do that maybe that's a lot maybe that is a lot maybe that is a lot thinking it's gonna disappear but it hasn't oh size man you doing that so I'm done with that I'm probably gonna change positions actually let's do that Come along. Hey guys, I'm back. So right now I'm gonna wash my face. I'm just gonna dampen it and then I'm gonna go in with a cleanser. So the cleanser I'm gonna go in with today, if I can find it, hold on. The cleanser I'm gonna go in with today is my Cause RX low ph good morning uh good morning gel cleanser this has got really good ingredients in there it's formulated with purifying botanical ingredients this low ph formula works to soothe refresh and soften the skin without stripping the feeling or without the stripping feeling that makes sense so what you can do is you can, go in, you can go in with this as a dry cleanse so without dampening your face first but I don't really do that I like dampening my face because I've got stuff already so let me just quickly do that okay my face is damp go in with that just a normal gel cleanser it's not really my first time using it. Um, I use it, I used to use it, but then I started acquiring a lot more um, of cleansers. Um, so I kind of stopped because I don't want to confuse my skin. Um, I feel like it's important to do that, like take necessary breaks for skin. You don't want to find yourself using stuff that your skin doesn't need just now and it's irritated because my skin usually does get irritated it does have tolerance for certain things but otherwise it runs down for me so
because my skin produces so much oils when I have makeup, I would rather have something that treats that and deals with the oils, not necessarily to strip them, but to um, control them in such a way that they are able to come out um, in, 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 a, in correct portions. So, because when I wear makeup, it's too excessive. So, what this little bit does, it basically absorbs everything for me. So, I just go in with that much and slather away.
hey guys i'm back i'm done with my bath it was absolutely amazing so while my skin is still wet while my skin is still dead rather i'm just gonna go in with my skin products i'm gonna go in with my usual the w beauty from Woolworths beauty this is their toner their purifying toner really amazing for normal to combination girls doesn't really sting on the eyes it's really gentle and it's cruelty free um also i think they promote vegan products let me see before i yeah it's vegan so no harmful products in this baby i've been using this for years now well not years I, i'd like to say two years yeah now that we're in december officially um i've been using it for for two years um at most um so so i'm gonna go in with i was gonna put on a mask a hydrating mask um but instead i think i'll just do a sleeping mask just because i'm really exhausted and i have an early morning I'm gonna go in with my Purion Cure. This is my essence toner. So, this is really exquisite gel. I'm lazy to take it out of the box. So, this is how I pour it out. That's it. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, that is how it looks on the skin. It's really, really beautiful. And it has no scent to it. I've also been using the, this for a couple of months now. Um, I saw it on, on um, the Beauty Within page, I think. Um, um, the YouTube uh, channel, Beauty Within. And I, I was a... And it just feels rough at the end of the day. So that's not nice. It's not a nice feeling to have, you know. It's really not. a shower and just unwind from the day i've been driving around a lot a lot so i just wanna relax put in some bath bombs and some put in some nice music and some salt that's the word i was looking for salt not salt um look at how dirty the mud up there is um, I'm going to just the second one. It's because I'm super pedantic about having makeup on. Like, I feel like every time I do makeup and every time I go, excuse me, every time I do my makeup for auditions, it literally always reminds me why I don't like putting on makeup. It's time consuming and my skin feels like it can't breathe. Like, it feels like it can't breathe because it's hugging and absorbing all of the oils and it's absorbing um, makeup, it's absorbing um, the pollution in the sky. It's a mess. It's a mess. It's a mess. So. It's something I don't really enjoy nowadays and every time I have to go to an audition it reminds me she I'm not gonna be able to wear my natural skin or maybe I can I just haven't found the castings that would allow me to do that because um, now I'm at least a little more comfortable and braver to go out barefaced um, so I want to start doing that, but you know you gotta always come up with a with a face, always look cute, you know, be presentable. But who's to say that your natural skin is not presentable? But that's a topic for another day. 
I just feel like having makeup and no shade to anyone who loves makeup I think I love makeup too it's an art form it's 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 a way of therapy for other people it's for other people it, it could be anything for you um, but my my thing is my relationship with with makeup has always been um, I wouldn't say love hate but it has always been weird it's always been in a weird place where I enjoy putting it on and I enjoy doing it but the fact that I'm gonna have to sweat it off or wear a mask and it's gonna melt that really puts me off and and um, back then I used to, I feel like I used to wear makeup for the wrong reasons now I'm wearing it for all the right reasons so like if I need to look go look for a job go pant then sure um, definitely I will wear a face because I want to look presentable for work for a certain character um, that the brief is, is, is looking for so um, I just feel like there <clears throat> just feel like that yeah, I just felt like I've been wearing makeup for all the wrong reasons and now that I'm getting on I'm at a point where I respect my skin now and I'm at a point where I I really and truly appreciate what it looks like and what it is and how far it's come to 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 look the way that it does I'm really proud of it I'm really proud of it Hold on a bit. I'm just gonna go get cotton buds and um, just go in here with my tight line and just remove the black because I don't want to sleep with like looking like a raccoon in my shape. Guys, we're back. I'll so I'm done wiping off my face right now. I'm just gonna go in with my micellar water and some cotton buds and just take care of my ass because okay. So it was not much. It removed. Wow. Okay. You know what? I actually should have checked the balm, how good it is, so I can review it. But you know what? They're not paying me. So I'm just going to show you how I get on, really. Um, yeah. I'm just going to do that. Let's see. gonna go in with my really 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 magnified um, <laughs> mirror and out okay, maybe not do that maybe that's a lot maybe that is a lot maybe that is a lot thinking it's gonna disappear but it hasn't I'm sorry, I'm not using that. so I'm done with that I'm probably gonna change positions actually let's do that Come along. Hey guys, I'm back. So right now I'm gonna wash my face. I'm just gonna put damp in it and then I'm gonna go in with the cleanser. So the cleanser I'm gonna go in with today, if I can find it, hold on. The I'm gonna go in with today is my Cause RX low ph good morning uh good morning gel cleanser this has got really good ingredients in there it's formulated with purifying botanical ingredients this low ph formula works to soothe refresh and soften the skin without stripping the feeling 
or without the stripping feeling that makes it so what you can do is you can go and you can go in with this as a dry cleanse so without dampening your face first but i don't really do that i like dampening my face because i've got stuff already so let me just quickly do that okay my face is damp It's not really my first time using it. Um, I use it, I used to use it, but then I started acquiring a lot more um, of cleansers. Um, so I kind of stopped because I don't want to confuse my skin. Um, I feel like it's important to do that, like take necessary breaks for skin. You don't want to find yourself using stuff that your skin doesn't need just now it's irritated because my skin usually does get irritated it does have tolerance for certain things but otherwise it was done for you as quiet as possible but the way that my parents are supposed to afford it they just like do what you need to do bruh Because my skin produces so much oils when I have makeup, I would rather have something that treats that and deals with the oils, not necessarily to strip them, but to um, control them in such a way that they are able to come out um, in, 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 a, in correct portions. So because when I wear makeup, it's too excessive. So what this little baby does, basically absorbs everything for me so I just go in with that much and slather away Thank you. 